Hello everyone, how are you? I hope you are feeling wonderfully well. It gives me great pleasure to greet you and welcome you once again. I confess that I do not want to extend the introduction too much because this video promises to be long. I would like to mention that this time we will talk about certain practical and functional decorative elements in the home where we should no longer invest money. These elements have become impractical and are no longer in trend. Not only that, they make your house look outdated. In this video, we will take a tour from the entrance of the house, passing through the living room, kitchen, and bedrooms, mentioning which parts we should avoid investing in each room. If you are planning to purchase a sofa, carpet, lighting fixtures, and other elements, I invite you to stay and watch this video. Avoid these four elements in the entrance. If you have a beautiful and spacious space in the entrance or vestibule of your house, decorate it appropriately with beautiful and functional elements. Even if it is a small space, it should still look good. Being practical does not mean spending a lot of money or acquiring the most expensive materials. There are affordable options that work just as well. The pieces you incorporate, such as lighting, are super important in this space since the lighting you choose influences the overall scenario. Avoid placing old-fashioned lamps or poor-quality luminaries that require only a single bulb, as they will provide dim lighting. Opt for better lamps that are well distributed and enrich the light in the space. You can choose to combine different ceiling or table lamps. If you have a console in place, I suggest that you do not invest in consoles covered in mirrors or intricately carved ones, as they no longer look modern and detract from the elegance of the decoration. Nowadays, consoles are mainly made of wood and other sober materials, which are trendy and create a more sophisticated and timeless space. Another element to avoid in the entrance or corridors of the house is a shag rug or medium pile rug. They are not practical in these areas and would be a wrong investment as they tend to get ruined and worn out quickly. I suggest using rugs made of strong synthetic fiber with short and heavy hair, so they stay fixed on the ground. Lastly, avoid investing in art with letters in this area or others in the house, as they no longer add elegance to the decoration. Despite their past popularity, especially those with welcome at the entrance, this trend no longer looks good. Instead, consider placing a large decorative painting or being creative by creating a well-combined photo gallery. Avoid these five elements in the living room. Let's start with the seating arrangement in the room. Although there aren't many people who follow this trend anymore, it's worth mentioning that bulky armchairs and fireplaces in the living room are outdated. My recommendation is to invest in seats that create a rich contrast, adding intensity and depth to the space. Opt for a comfortable sofa that fits your needs preferably in a neutral color like gray or beige. Combine it with contrasting armchairs in terms of tonality, materials, textures, and shapes. This will give your living room a dynamic and visually appealing look. 
The trend of painting the walls entirely in grey has become outdated. Instead, play with different shades, shapes, colors, and textures to add personality to your living room. If you love the cold grey tone for the walls, consider adding warm undertones to the rest of the decor. For example, you can have a grey sofa with warm undertones paired with white seats, cushions in beige or tan tones, and details of natural wood fibers. Don't forget to incorporate a touch of black among other elements to create contrast. Functional lighting is important in the living room, but avoid outdated matching lamps. Instead, opt for different formats, styles, and materials for your table and floor lamps to create a versatile and flattering lighting mix. Avoid these three elements in the dining room. The dining room should look as elegant as the living room or bedroom. However, there are decorative pieces that no longer fit the current trends. Avoid investing in matching furniture sets, including the table, chairs, showcase, and buffet, all in the same wood tone. This creates a dated and characterless look. Opt for contrast in tonalities, designs, and textures to achieve balance and harmony. For example, a wooden table with upholstered chairs in a modern design and a wooden buffet in a different and darker tone than the table would be a great combination. In terms of lighting, exposed light bulbs or industrial-style luminaries are not suitable for a dining room. Instead, create a dim and relaxing atmosphere with hanging lamps and direct lighting that complements the space.
include these three elements in the kitchen, modern kitchens embrace furniture in different colors, from light to dark tones, following the current trends. Avoid investing in dark wooden kitchen furniture, as it can make your kitchen look old and too dark. If you want to update your kitchen, consider polishing, painting, or varnishing the existing wooden furniture to refresh the space. Additionally, opt for stainless steel appliances instead of white ones for a more contemporary look. Taps in both the kitchen and bathroom have evolved, offering more sophisticated and modern alternatives. Avoid investing in outdated options and choose designs that match the contemporary style of your kitchen and bathroom. Avoid these two elements in the bedroom. In the bedroom, the main focus is the bed. While upholstered headboards are still used and can look spectacular, some designs are becoming outdated. Avoid bulky and striking headboards, and opt for practical and simpler versions that are of lower proportion and versatile. When it comes to textiles in the bedroom, Avoid bedspreads with bold and vibrant colors or designs that make the room visually overloaded and dated. Instead, choose neutral or patterned bedding in soft and subtle tones to create an elegant and elevated look. In conclusion, this video aims to provide useful information and fresh ideas for decorating our homes. Remember that these suggestions are not meant to judge anyone's personal style but to inspire and help each other in creating beautiful and up-to-date living spaces. Thank you for watching, and I hope you found this content interesting and valuable.